Fires out! Did you think to take any extinguishers when you stole the ship? Blast! Outland! Rush! See what you can do with this thing. That's two more shuttles you owe me. You didn't even own this one. It really shouldn't count. It was mine when it crashed. It counts. I didn't realize we were being billed for this level of service. It's just a little game we have. You will be reimbursed. Of course. Never doubted it. Anything on your sensors? Confirmation. I have detected a large metallic object nearby. Analysis suggests a technological construct, but there are no energy readings. Whatever it is, it's got better chances of flying than this thing. Engines fried to a crisp. Sky Troopers won't be far behind us. We need to hide the evidence of our landing. I'll scavenge you, Barry. Just like Aaron Prime. I get the sense you two have been working together for a while. Long enough. I know you have more questions than answers, but we should really keep moving. I promise I'll tell you everything I can as soon as we're safe. Enthusiasm. Shall we investigate the technological object? I believe I can guide us to its location. Very well.
Master? Clarification. Master Benico altered my programming before we secured your release. I am to serve you with the same unexcelled loyalty with which I serve her. In fact, your survival is now my highest priority. I'm no more important than Lana or Koth. Don't prioritize me above them. Concession. I will alter my prioritization as you request, Master. Gossip. You are just as selfless as I had been led to believe. Resumption. Shall we continue? Is this the object you picked up on your sensors? Confirmation. Yes, Master. A closer scan suggests that this object has been here for several centuries. Centuries? 
of all the junk out here, you had to find the antique. Observation. Visible design elements do not match any from Zakulan culture, antique or modern. Not from Zakul. Could it be? He doesn't overthink things. <laughs> Do you have any idea what this is? It looks like some kind of old spacecraft. This is the Gravestone. This was the only ship that ever went up against the Eternal Fleet and won. Do you have any idea how long people have been looking for this thing? And we just happened to stumble upon it. You said this ship went up against the Eternal Fleet and won, but it's rusting in a swamp while the fleet is still around. The fleet is even older than Valkyria, maybe even older than Zakul. The battles happened centuries ago. Nobody knows the details of the whole war, but every story talks about the Gravestone, one ship with the firepower to take on the Eternal Fleet. This is fate. We get your Outlander. Find exactly the weapon we need. We're going to win this thing, Mana. It's destiny. It's certainly no coincidence, but destiny? I think there's something else going on here. You think this is some kind of setup? No, not exactly. I can't quite put my finger on it. Let's have a look inside, huh? Assessment. Nearby signs of animal activity suggest local predators may be using this wreck as a nesting ground. Caution is advised. We'll split up, deal with any wildlife, then regroup to plan our next move. Got you covered. Thank <laughs> you. 
After the damage you inflicted, they couldn't have made a safe landing anywhere else. And if they didn't make a safe landing? We'll know soon enough. Sky Troopers, sweep the area. Focus on regions with high metallic sensory. security in the Carbonite prison. I... I humbly submit myself to answer for this failure. Sister... I didn't like his answer. So, this ship has been here for a thousand years. More. Right. It's amazing that it's in such good condition, considering. Judging by the damage I've seen, the stories are true. Whoever built the Gravestone scuttled it themselves after the Eternal Fleet was defeated. It wasn't shot down. The fleet was defeated, but not destroyed. Valkorion brought it back under his own control more than a century ago. Exactly. The Eternal Fleet is totally automated. Nobody knows who first built it. And every theory is crazier than the last. Renegades left behind after a successful droid revolution. Representatives of an entire race of droids from somewhere beyond the edge of the known galaxy. Like I said, crazy stuff. But no matter where it came from, the Eternal Fleet is practically unstoppable. And Arkin controls every single ship from the throne. So if we defeat Arkin, the Eternal Fleet isn't a problem anymore? So long as the throne goes to someone other than his sister, yes. Regardless, we have many other things to discuss. I owe you five years worth of explanations. And I'm gonna need some parts to get this thing moving again. Locating supplies and fresh water would also be wise. I'll help you find what we need, Lana. Very well. A session. I will begin a patrol pattern to ensure that no enemy forces report our position. Oh, <laughs> oh, 